great chart. Um, when DeAndre is defending as well as he was tonight, I mean, how much of a difference does that make for you guys? Yeah, I mean, he always defends that way. I mean, when he's when he's playing, he's always defending that way. So, I mean, it's it's just all about if he's gonna be on the court. And when he's on the court, our team is a lot better. And uh, you saw what he was able to do tonight, I mean, being able to guard. Um, Luca's obviously one of the toughest guards to guard in this league. So, uh, the way the way he just tried to slow him down as much as possible, he did a great job. What do you uh, I mean, it makes everybody's job easier. Uh, whenever he's he's guarding like that, he's he's playing hard. It's like you you don't have to help as much. I mean, the 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 point of the game is every team is trying to get a guy who draws two people towards him because I mean, this is a league. Everybody should be able to score. So when you have a guy who can play straight up on on somebody, it makes it makes the whole team defense that much better. So it's it's a lot better for our team. Trey, we, um, I think last week we talked in practice and you talked about how last year was a good season, but you want last year to be last year and this year to be this year. How much importance was it in this first game to just be in the moment and focus on right now going into this season? Uh, it's always important. Every every game is important, uh, but obviously this is the start of a new season, a new year. We wanted to start out on a, a great note and um, – uh, it's, it's, it's good that we started out one and know it's a lot of games left, so uh, I don't want to get too high, too low any part of the season, but we got a, we got a lot of games to go, and uh, it's was, it was good to get a 1-0 start. Trey, back here, uh, over, over here. Over here, back here. You took almost 20 minutes to score your first point. Seven other your teammates scored before. How much confidence does that give you that you don't have to be the man you can even – you know, let the let the game come to you that way. Yeah, I mean, that I mean, it makes it that much easier when you got guys around you that um, can make plays. I had a, I, I started out slow trying to get everybody involved, and they were they were looking for me to get more people involved instead of my shot for myself. And I had a lot of boneheaded plays that I mean, if I could go back and, and do it over again, I'd probably be more aggressive early on and look for my shot more than than other people because they were they were focused on that and me getting everybody else involved. So. I think that after I made a couple shots to go down, um, it started opening up for everybody else too. So uh, I think it's it's uh, it's good to have guys to have that can go make plays. Uh, two questions, uh, Trey. Uh, first of all, what kind of statement do you guys think you made defensively tonight? Uh, I mean, I think the defensively we're we're a, we're a good team, especially when you have Cam Reddish and Dre out there, Clint. In the bag, JC is, is taking another step. I mean, every year on the defensive end, and then you got Kevin getting better. Everybody's getting better on the defensive end, so it's a it's a, a good thing and a good thing to have. And about the shirt, how did Atlanta, Georgia, change your life? Oh, man. what's the what's the meaning of that message? Man, they, they they traded up to draft me. <laughs> that's that's pretty much it. They, this this has been like my second home. Uh, I don't I haven't moved anywhere growing up, really. I've been in Oklahoma my whole life, so uh, coming here to Atlanta has been amazing. Hey, Trey, uh, back here. Um, I just wonder, uh, maybe not for you, but what's the competition like for minutes uh, just to get on the floor with a team this deep? Yeah, I mean, it's, that's, I mean, it's a, a good problem to have, I guess. Uh, we got so many guys who can play, and uh, I know Nate is, is uh, probably stressing out on how to get everybody minutes and get everybody in the game because uh, we have so many good players. Um, but that's that's a that's a good thing about our team. We can go deep into the bench. Um, we have guys in foul trouble, guys out for whatever reasons. We we have guys on the bench who can come in and make plays and step in right away. So I think it's a good problem to have. Um, with John specifically, in in what ways have you seen him grow? defensively I know from where he started as a rookie it's been a gradual yeah. progression so in what ways have you seen him grow uh he's man he's, he's grown in every area I mean his jump shot uh I mean he's just IQ for the game he's he's always learning uh he's always he's always talking uh he always wants to learn and um I mean he's still young he's still going to get better so it's it's amazing how much he's, he's gotten better on the defensive end and he just he goes for every shot um can test um, he, and he's knocking down shots, too, for us. So it's big for us. Switching to Zoom, question from Terrell Thomas. 
Uh, hey, Trey, congratulations on the win tonight. Uh, Two-part question. It looked like you had a new color wave as far as your sneakers are concerned uh, tonight. Could you talk mm -hmm. to me about that if so? And then what went behind uh, the themes for, for your colorways? A lot of Atlanta love, what went behind the themes? Yeah, I mean, uh, it's my first shoe. I mean, uh, like I just said, I got drafted here. So I got to I gotta pay homage to the city and, and give respect to the city. And I just, it's a nice colorway. I just had it with the, the, the team colors. Um, just wanted to throw out a team colorway tonight. And I thought it was cool. Uh, I got a lot of stuff coming though. Thank you. Next question from Leonardo Torres. Hi, Trey. It's Leonardo Torres from Peru. Congrats on the win. Trey, how is it to play with such a good shooter? Same mean, tonight you finished with 14 assists. Yeah, uh, it's, it's, it's fun. Uh, I got a lot of guys who can make plays um, from top to bottom. So it's, uh, they make my job look a lot easier. Um, how important do you feel it was to come out with such a statement victory like you guys had beating them? Beating a good team by you know over twenty points. Yeah, uh, obviously it's just one game, and we just we know um, how important it is after being in the playoffs to to take and approach every game seriously. Um, try to get a I mean a higher seed than we did last year. Uh, so obviously it's just one game, but it was very important to come out and uh, and uh, leave a statement. Obviously at home and make this place a tough place to play. So. Next question from Davide Cinelato. Hi, Trey Davide from Italy here. Uh, what makes you most excited about this team perspective this season? Um, I mean, everything. We got a lot of guys coming back, and then uh, with the new guys that we've added, it's just made our team that much better. So I'm just excited to just play this season out and just continue to, to learn and build this chemistry with these guys and, I mean, to see where everything goes. Final question comes from Emmanuel Glaze. Trey, how electric was State Farm for you tonight? It, the fans were outstanding from the beginning to the end. Just talk about the energy that you guys received when y'all stepped on the floor. Yeah, no, nah, it, it was a lot of energy. Um, definitely, definitely felt a lot of the, the energy tonight. Um, maybe if the Braves weren't about to go to the World Series, we'd have a lot more people in the building, but I'm happy for them. We hope, we hope they make it. Um, and, and win it all. So, but no, I think, I think uh, with that going on, I mean, we had a great turnout tonight and uh, it was, it was uh, good. Thanks, Trey. Appreciate it.